Queen snubbed after Joe Biden ordered not to bow for Her Majesty. The Queen appeared to be snubbed by Joe Biden, after the US President was ordered not to bow for Her Majesty. Mr. Biden and First Lady Jill Biden met the Queen at Windsor Castle yesterday following the end of the G7 summit in Cornwall. The visit included a guard of honor and afternoon tea with the monarch, who is said to have asked him about China's Xi Jinping and Russia's Vladimir Putin. Mr. Biden lavished praise on the 95-year-old, stating afterwards, I don't think she'd be insulted but she reminded me of my mother, the look of her and just the generosity. The White House revealed that Mr. Biden had met the Queen before, in 1982 when he was a young senator. And it was his own mother who gave him a piece of advice. In a memoir he published several years ago, he stated that she told him, don't you bow down to her. According to reports, he did not bow for her on Sunday, which some saw as a snub, but it is not a breach of royal protocol. One Twitter user noted, aren't people supposed to bow or curtsy as a form of respect to the Queen? Just curious. Another added, is there a reason Biden and his wife didn't bow for the Queen? And a third claimed, they were supposed to curtsy and bow to her. Don't they have any manners? There are no obligatory codes of behavior when meeting the Queen, but many people wish to observe the traditional form. For men, this is a neck bow, while women do a small curtsy, but many world leaders have chosen not to do this before. The Queen has met every US president since World War II, with the exception of Lyndon Johnson, and there have been a number of blunders. In 2018, Donald Trump was criticized for both walking in front of her and putting his hand on her back. In 2009, Michelle Obama briefly put her arm around the Queen's back as the two shared complaints about their aching feet at a reception for the G20 group of world leaders in London. And, in 2007, George W. Bush misspoke, saying the Queen helped the U.S. celebrate its bicentennial in 17. Quote. Before catching himself, and quickly correcting the date to 1976. Mr. Bush said afterwards, she gave me a look that only a mother could give a child.